Hello, welcome to Spanish cooking. Today we are preparing zucchini omelette. It's like the traditional Spanish omelette, but we will include not only potatoes, but also onion and zucchini. So as usual, the first thing you need to do is to peel some potatoes. This time we will use less because the other ingredients are uh, zucchini and um, onion. So I normally cut them in halves and then in no, uh, once again in half and then I slice finely. It doesn't matter whether your slices are thick or thin. The important thing is that those are equal in size more or less then for this um, recipe I'm using like the equal amount of um, zucchini and potatoes but you can adjust it uh, as you wish and I'm doing the same thing I'm cutting in half and then in quarters and slicing the zucchini finely this way I, I like to do it quite fine quite thin because then the cooking time will be less so you have to make sure all your ingredients are uh, cooked through especially the potatoes because if the potatoes raw then it's not it's not nice and then for the onion as you see here i used half a big onion but it's up to you you could even remove it if you don't like so you end up with these three ingredients all chopped and prepared now you will fry them in olive oil i really recommend you to use good quality olive oil because then the flavor will be much much nicer you could use uh, vegetable oil like uh, sunflower seed oil as well but olive oil it's nicer now at high heat i start frying it with the lid off for the first two three minutes or four until you see it starts to really be hot temperature and then i cover and i keep like this for uh, five six minutes and you see here you start seeing uh, golden brown pieces so that's what you want to achieve because these brown pieces will bring extra flavor and now it starts to look nicer like here i uncover it completely and i let it reduce for uh, extra 10 minutes or so until it's completely done don't forget to add some salt at this moment not before because then it would uh, release too much water to the oil and uh, drain your ingredients and now we will crack three eggs and beat them with a bit of salt just a pinch of salt with a fork is nice to beat it so it doesn't have to be beaten for a long time just mixed thoroughly and now you can add your um, mixture of potato zucchini and onion you will see here you can drain like a second time because it will release yet more uh, oil so um, it's nice to drain uh, as much oil as you can now you mix it and it's ready to the last step now in the very hot pan with just a drop of oil you pour all your ingredients in and then you need to be like this continue continuously moving the pan making sure it doesn't stick until it's halfway done so it's important that your heat is not too high because then it will be burnt and flip it carefully after five minutes or so when you see that is halfway done and pour it again in the pan and cook for uh, two or three more minutes so this time for this side the cooking time will be less because it will be cooked through completely in two or three minutes or depending on your on the thickness of your tortilla but normally it it will be more than enough and now your tortilla is ready to serve i like to let it cool for five minutes or so and uh, you will see that this tortilla is uh, softer than the original one it's really nice so i really recommend you to try this out and of course don't forget to enjoy it see you soon